Hey guys, welcome back. This is Jex on the channel, The Jexter. Today I'm going to show you how to get into the uh, Bedrock Editor. And so the easiest way to do it is you go over to your Minecraft launcher. If you haven't, download that, get it installed. And then we can come over here to Minecraft win for Windows. And we click on the preview. And we click on install. That way you make sure you got the latest one. Pick your, pick your drive that you want to install it on. Let it do it. It's about 80 megabytes or so to, to download. So we'll let it download. And while we're doing it, it's talking about it. Uh, Minecraft Preview lets a bedrock owner experience unreleased upcoming features fresh from the dev team at Mojang Studios. And then you click on that to learn more about it. Uh, so while it's downloading, I'm going to grab a file. Okay, so we got it downloaded. Uh, next thing we want to do is click minimize this. And we're going to go on our desktop and click on right click and click on new click on shortcut and we're going to paste this down in it minecraft colon question mark editor equals true and it has to be just like this you can't it has to be spelled just like exactly like that so we're going to click on next and we'll name this minecraft editor i'm just saving you a lot of time instead of going through the documentation i'll set the documentation down in the description also also so click on finish and it looks like this is going to a different thing by, by the name of the logo here. So what we want to do maybe is go back over to the launcher. Make sure we launch this one time. And then we can sign in. We see we have the right version up here. Okay, we click on let's go. Okay, so we got the right version and everything. I want to close this back up because we need to, let's make sure we go down here to properties. Make sure that's in here. Security. Okay, you may get a pop-up window. Let's see if I can grab a screenshot of this real quick because I can't switch it over. And I'm gonna show you what that looks like real quick. I know this is gonna be kind of kludgy but this is what it's going to show up like. And you want to click on Minecraft Preview when it shows up, okay? So let's close this up. I'm doing this on my alt account, so that's why things aren't working like normal. And that, the reason I'm doing it on my uh, alt account is because I've already set it up on uh, my main account. So let's click on this again. And I'm going to click on the Minecraft preview just like I showed you. And I'm going to click always because it's the editor. And then you just need to create a world. I'm going to leave it in survival. I'm going to switch to peaceful because when I'm building, I don't want mobs bothering me. Uh, click on advanced. Um, you can turn this on, stuff on if you want or not. Make sure you go over to your Minecraft. I'm going to or multiplayer, I'm going to turn off invited to invited in players only so people don't join my world. Uh, you can turn the cheats on. I don't think we need to do that though. Experiments, I'm going to turn these on. Keep, oh, I need to go to experimental. Next major update, sniffer, because if I want to mess with those, and then I'm going to click on create. and let it load up. It may take a few seconds for it to load up. We can proceed if, you, if that pops up. And we should get right into the, the editor right away when it loads up. There we go. So there you go, guys. I've already made a short video on some of the things you can do here, but at least this will get you so you can start editing. Uh, if you need more help, more details, whatever, let me know down in the comments and I'll 
get back with you, okay? Uh, and if I decide we need a more detailed uh, tutorial on this, I'll do that too. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye.